you must know about top 10 AWS services if you want to become a AWS DevOps engineer. Number one, that is AWS Code Commit. And it is a managed source control service that hosts secure Git-based repositories and also facilitates collaboration among teams and integrates well with other AWS services, okay? Now, number two, that is AWS Code Pipeline. Now, this service automates the stages of your release process such as build, test, and deployment. It helps in continuous integration and continuous delivery that is CI-CD workflow process as well. Now, third one, that is AWS Code Build. And it is a fully managed build service that compiles your source code, run test and produces software packages. And it is scalable and integrated with all the AWS services for a complete build and release tool chain. Okay. Now the fourth one, that is AWS Code Deploy. And this automates code deployment to any instances, including Amazon EC2 services, and also on-premise servers. And AWS Code Deploy help in avoiding downtime during deployment. Now, the fifth one, which is the container services. And what are the container services we have available? We have Amazon Elastic Container Service, which is ECS, and Amazon Elastic Kubernetes Service, which is EKS. Now, these services are used for running containerized application in AWS. And ECS is highly scalable, high-performance container management service, while EKS offer a managed Kubernetes service which is more than capable. Now the sixth one that is AWS CloudFormation. Now it enables you to use template file to model and provision all the AWS resources as needed for your application across all region and all accounts. Okay, And this service helps in infrastructure as code practices as well. Now the seventh one that is AWS Elastic Beanstalk and it's a very easy to use for deploying and scaling your application and services and it support programming languages such as Java, .NET, PHP, Node.js, Python, Ruby, Go and Docker. Okay. Now the eighth one that is Amazon CloudWatch and this provide monitoring and observability for your AWS services and application. It supports login, metrics and event data. Now the ninth one that is AWS Lambda. And a serverless compute service that let you run code without provisioning or managing the servers. And it integrates well with other AWS services for building scalable applications. Now, the 10th one, that is AWS System Manager. And this helps manage your AWS resources. It enables you to automate the operational task to improve productivity and reduce the human error. Now you know 10 AWS services that is important to become an AWS DevOps engineer and and all the services that I talked about, I already made videos on that and I will share the playlist link in the first comment, uh, first pin comment. Please go and check it out if you would like to learn all that things. And if you're new to this channel, please do subscribe my channel for your support and like this video and share with others for your knowledge sharing. Okay. Thank you and see you again in my next video.